This is an exciting morning on Wake Up. The newest member of the Buffalo Sabres is definitely the cutest and maybe most energetic on the team. Yeah, he just jumped right up and got right in our laps. Rick is here. He's an eight-month-old <laughs> eight Newfoundland rescued by the Niagara County SBCA. He's got some lab in him, too, and he's doing a big old stretch. Yeah. And he's here this morning with his trainer, Chris Krieger, who is an Iraq War veteran. So we thank you for your service. Thanks. Uh, tell us about Rick. He is a bunch of whole lot of personality. He, he is, yeah. Up. So he came from the Niagara County SPCA. They uh, found him walking the street. Uh, no one ever came to claim him. And when the Buffalo Sabres had reached out to us to see if we would be willing to partner on this initiative, yeah. um, we jumped on it. So we, we found Rick at the SPCA, took some pictures, sent him off, and, you know, the Buffalo Sabres said, let's do it. So... And why are this? Why is Rick the dog for the job? Why is Rick, you know, going to be a great, you know, representative for the team? Look at him. Right? He's just a, a ball of fun. Um, he is so yeah. sweet. We have never had a dog do this. Just he's all over all, and he just wants some really good pets. Oh yeah. yeah. He just wants. He to thinks be he's good. a big lap loved. dog. Um, you know, so right now it's early in the morning. We haven't had a chance to run all the energy out of yeah. him. Yeah. Um, he is being housed at the Niagara County Correctional Facility. Okay. Um, so once we leave here, we're going to be taking him back to the jail and work him there for another two hours and get all this out of him. And so uh, great. what exactly, what, what's the training that he has to go through? Because it's a, it's a long process. What kinds of things will he it be is. doing? So our trainer is John Knopf. <laughs> um, he trains all of our, all of our dogs. Um, Rick will be housed at the Niagara County Correctional Facility for the next 10 months, where John and myself visit and train all the dogs that are there. And then in 10 months, we will pull the dog out and pair him up with a veteran. But with Rick, what we're going to do is um, pair him up uh, on the ice with the Sabres last game. Okay. And bring down a veteran who's been on our waiting list and surprise him or her with the dog. I love My that. gosh, he is just a ball of love. He really is so, so friendly. I know a lot of people are hoping that they can get to meet Rick this sure. season. Uh, do you know specifically <laughs> what kind of, what games he'll be at? Not specifically. Okay. I know we are working on getting him at more games, getting him familiar um, with all the different sounds and the surroundings out yes. in the community. It can be um, a, a lot for, yeah. for an as you can see. So, <laughs> you know, desensitize him, socialize him get him used to what his new life is going to be like out in the community. All I, right. I think he's going to do just fine. I think so, too. <laughs> he's going to he be is awesome. such yeah. a sweetie. Of course, Rick is named after Rick Generat, too. Right. I just, we love that name. Yeah, Perfect we, we name. certainly do. Yeah. That's, I know, what Kelsey, well, I was, I was rooting for that one. The public got to pick out his name, and I think it fits his personality. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> thank you so much for coming in this morning, and thank yeah. you uh, for your service again. Thanks for having us. Appreciate it. Yep. Well, stay with us. Mike is updating us with that forecast when we come back.